Hey guys and girls, King Lear here from Proceed to Checkpoint, joined by... Grayson. And we are going to be doing another... White Circle. <laughs> Japan Crate unboxing. <laughs> like an inverted Japan flag, Japanese flag. Um, been a while since we've done one of these, so I'm intrigued to see what comes out of it. This is an older one I've had there for a while, so hopefully the candy hasn't gone off. I don't think candy goes off though, so we're probably okay. Hopefully not Japanese stuff. Yeah. Um, cool, so let's crack this open and see what we have inside. Ooh. Loads of stuff. Loads of stuff. Loads of crisps. These things are always presented very lovely. There we go. You know, always looks really good. <laughs> Use the beard. Use the beard, yeah. There we go. You can see it all in there now. <laughs> and the book on top. Let's talk about everything. And it goes back to front because it's a manga. Um, and that's, that's what it looks like. Volume 16. And it's got a little witch on the front. Oh, wow, that's from October. <laughs> that's from October. <laughs> this has back, been here a while. <laughs> it's got the scaredy girl and the witch's thing or majigger. So, looking at this straight out, I don't think I'm going to have a good time with this one. Why? What's the problem? Some of the stuff in here just doesn't look... It doesn't appeal to you? No. There's like some cream cheese things and stuff like that. Uh, this is that Happy like. Halloween with Japan Crate. Happy Halloween, guys. <laughs> Sweet. Okay, shall we? Shall let's, we jump let's into get this? Started. So this looks like temporary tattoos. Oh. Yeah, it's got the little rubby part on the back. Yeah. Is there any... Is it like chewing gum with temporary tattoos? Because they used to do that here, right? Did they? Oh, they did. Because they had like the Spider-Man like little one piece, one cube mm. gum thing. So. I remember the Spider-Man ones, specifically. Um, Spider-Man's my boy! Yeah, so, that's gum, alright. Yeah. It is chewing gum with uh, some temporary tattoos Maybe inside. We'll We'll put them on later and look like badasses. There's some fang marks. Oh. And what looks like some red... Well, fang marks. It's just teeth marks, really. Uh, and what looks like some plague. red blood cells or something. Just some plague. Yeah. Um, the chewing gum. It just smells like normal... Bubblegum flavoured something. Bubblegum, like, yeah. Um, huh. Kawaii. I'm scared. Scary. Okay. So not kawaii, but kawaii. Kawaii. So cute and scary are very, very close then Similar, in Japanese. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. This feels like it's probably a chocolate bar. There's a lovely cute picture of a dog on the front of it. Oh, pupper. Oh. Is that more gum? This? Yeah. I think it's chocolate. Oh, okay. Like an animal bear. Literally. Um... Doge! It's a fucking doge! <laughs> <laughs> There's a doge inside. Collect them all. It's a little corgi. This is number 13. Welsh Corgi Pembroke. Nice. And then there's a little picture of the doge going for a run on the back. Bristol would like that. And he, loves, a, he loves corgis. There's a little speech bubble you can... You scrape it off or... Right in... Maybe. <laughs> it doesn't seem to scrape off. You take a look at the chocolate, I'll take a look at this. Alright, let's crack open the chocolate then. I'm pretty sure it is chocolate, yeah. What the fuck? Okay. Ooh. Yeah, I don't know I what know. that is. So this is... Oh. Uh, chocolate with like Rice Krispies or something inside it from the look of it. That's exactly what that is. Yeah. It's quite nice. Yeah, it's really quite nice. It's all right, yeah. Hmm. Ooh. It gets a little bit... I don't know, it's a little bit thick about it. Mmm. 
you leave it in your mouth for too long. Yeah, I'm I'm not I'm not quite sure I'm about that. I'm not digging it. I'm not I'm not digging it, man. It's not it's my still thing. in date, at least. <laughs> <laughs> well that's a plus. <laughs> Oh my god, look what you could have gotten if you would gotten the Sugoi crate. You could have gotten a Pokemon Center exclusive Pikachu plucky. plushie. Oh my god. With he's got like little Zubat wings, a large Gengar plush, a King Boo sensor desk lamp, uh, Nintendo Select, or Super Mario 3D Land new 3DS bundle, new Super Select, Nintendo Select Luigi's Mansion, uh, a Play Arts Kai Halloween Sora from Kingdom Hearts. A Godzilla coin bank and uh, a giant strawberry pocky. That's the least cool thing on that list. Yeah. So it shows you everything that you could possibly win in that particular month's Sugoi crate. There's the Pikachu's looking badass. Um, and there's the Sora over there. But yeah, it's um, it's super cool. And why didn't you get this one? Why didn't you get the Sugoi crate? Very good question. Very good question. Come on, Japan Crate, get your shit together. So this is a drink of some kind. It looks like it's gonna be orange flavored. I'm guessing by the big Mandarin. orange on front of it. Mandarin flavored, maybe. Blood so, orange. Here you go. Like last last thing. Oh, there's bits in it. Wow, there's. I'm not sure if you can see that, chunks but there's like literal chunks floating in it. Oh. You go first. What's it like? It's okay. Texturally? Texturally, it's fine. Um, it's like orange juice with, with uh, bits in it. It's... Um, Ugh, I don't like bits. It's very... Bland. It's bland, yeah. Ugh. Ugh. I hate bits in my orange juice. That's why when I've, whenever I buy orange juice, I get smooth. So you can... Hear. Yeah. That's very... Bland. I hate bits. There's no strong taste off it at all. Like, um, I think we've had these before. I think we've had these before. A little Indian on them. Yeah. 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 We have had these before. I'm pretty sure we got these in a previous crate. And they were just crisp. Yeah. Didn't you say something recently about them making these like a little bit better? Yes. So they're moving their offices to Japan, I believe. So, because they're based right, right now in, like, San Francisco or something like that, I think. Mm -hmm. So, the crates are going to be bigger, it's going to be cheaper, and they'll be getting the stuff directly in Japan as well. So, there should hopefully be better stuff in it. It's really salted crisp. Yeah. Yeah. We've definitely We've had, definitely them, had before, them before, yeah. yeah. Like, they're grand. Yeah. Nothing wrong with ready salted crisps. But they're just ready salted crisps. I want some crazy shit from Japan, you know? I don't know what this is. Yeah. It's a little silver bag with a little white guy on the front. There's little things inside. Okay. Okay. They're little balls. Alright. Oh, they're hard. Oh, I'm yeah. Mint. All right. No. Yes. No. It kind of. I don't know. It tastes what. a little bit nutty. And now it doesn't. What the hell is that flavor? I don't know. And there's some fruit. They're all over the place. I'd love to know what. This is supposed to be. Hang on. I can't tell the flavor. I'll take a look in the book. Oh, yeah. Um, I, it's leaving me guessing. Huh. Hmm. Having a healthy stomach is important, so you can eat more snacks. This unique candy has probiotic bacteria to promote good digestion and comes in a, a soothing yogurt flavor. So that's why it tastes so weird. It's healthy and it's yogurt flavor. Yeah. Okay. That makes sense. I don't remember yogurts tasting like that though. No. This is more gum. Oh, lovely. Yep, that's gum, all right. With a picture of a zombie on it. 
I have a feeling this is just going to be normal gum. Just regular as gum, well, same yeah. as the rest of it. We can probably skip eating the gum, considering all that happens is it all tastes the same, and we I end up with a desk half just... full of chewing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Pretty. But we'll have a look to see if there's anything inside it. Mm. Okay, there is. Okay, so there's, yeah, again, the a big bag for a, a little tiny square of gum. Square of gum, but it does have uh, some stickers inside it. Right. Some stickers, and uh, oh, a zombie face as well. So you can put the stickers oh, onto the zombie face and works. make your own little zombie. That's cool. It's fine, mm. you know. It's good for kids, I guess. Is this another one of those ice cream things? This is an ice cream DIY thing, yeah. We made one of those in a previous video. We probably won't make it again, will we? Probably not. I'll link you uh, in an annotation at the end to see the previous video because I think this is the exact same ice cream thing that we had exact same. at that point. Um, what else have we got? We have... Oh, wow, this is cute. Ooh. What's that now? Just like an ornament? I think it's just a little toy, yeah. That's adorable. Yeah, that's kind of nice. A little cupcake and a, that's a thing. I'm going to consult the book. A mail order company covering accessories and sundry goods for junior high girls. <laughs> Apparently. Perfect for you. Yeah. Hoppy Chan. Happy chan is well known in Japan for her cute squishy cheeks and her sparkling eyes. Until recently she's been a Doki Doki Crate exclusive, but we wanted to share her with our Japan Crate community as well. She comes in an array of colours and styles. What did you get? To find out more about Happy chan see page 8. So what's on page 8? I don't know what this is, guys. That looks like dog food. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. This is going to be jerky of some kind, I think. Uh, just a I'm not a big fan of jerky. I like jerky. Yeah. Yeah. Poppy Chan became a big hit, uh, and even has her own store in Harajuku. Poppy Chan accessories come in a multitude of colors and styles, <laughs> and are known for their attention to detail. Fashion models, fashion brands, and even characters like Hello Kitty and Crayon Shin Chan have exclusive collaborations with her. Doki Doki crates included. Yeah, it's fine. It's another crate. So what's it smell like? It's definitely got a funk to it. Oh. Um, should I read about what this is before we eat it? See if you can see a date on it first, because this is a meat product. I, I assume it's fine. Yeah, February it's grand, 2017, yeah. Yeah, okay, right. It's got a bit of spice. You're not eating that. No. I'm not. Oh. Well, that's I'm not eating that. Wow. That's not great. That's um, pretty, pretty poor. Oh. It reminds me of one time I had reindeer jerky <laughs> and it was horrible. Because it could was not really be further from strong. what it actually is. Oh, really? Yeah. This jerky is made from soybeans and contains no actual meat. What? Yeah. Uh, yeah, pretty much. Yeah, vegetarian jerky. No wonder it's shit. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what else have we got? This is the thing that I wasn't so sure about. Butter. Yeah. We don't have a very good history no. of butter in these Japan crates. Um, creamy and crispy pie. I mean, let's chance it. But I'm already expecting bad things. Oh, individually wrapped. Okay. So this, they're shaped like little love hearts as well or something. I was gonna go with Pac-Man, but all right. So this is the things. Oof. I, like, I don't like 
any kind of butter. I don't even put it on sandwiches, so this is probably not going to go well. You don't like butter? No. What the fuck's wrong with you, man? Yeah, that's it's all great. right. It's fine. It's a butter cook. It's a butter cookie. Yeah. That's all it is. Ah. Huh. You basically get tinned of these at Christmas here. You do, yeah. <laughs> Everyone has a tin of cookies that taste just like this. Everyone has that same tin as well, full of sewing and knitting supplies as well. Yeah. At home. Yeah. Yeah. I love how that's a thing. Yeah. And like, it's always that everyone, tin, that one and tin. everyone has it, yeah. independently of each other. Like. Mm -hmm. It's a nice tin, you know? Oh, we're getting in there now. This that looks hilarious. Can you the label <laughs> Blah. <laughs> Blah. <laughs> Gum? Again? I'd say so. Maybe. Hello. What's that writing on it? looks a bit more Thai than Japan. Yeah, it's just gum. Yep, that is gum, alright. Part of the name of this candy is be, which is the sound you make when you stick out your tongue in Japanese. Okay. Uh, these two fun Specifically sticks... Specifically in Japanese. Yep. <laughs> these two fun sticks of candy, chewy candy, will dye your tongue either a bright blue or bright green. Give it a shot, open up and say bleh. Do we try that then? Give it a go, yeah. Yeah. Um, let's actually have that towards the end. Okay. And um, we can... Pocky! 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 I don't know what flavour this is. Um, vanilla? Milk. Milk flavour. Okay. Mm, yogurt, I guess. Um, I'm down to fun. Yeah, Pocky's nice. In fact, I have two empty boxes of it on the floor over there. <laughs> it's that nice. Yeah. Don't if know. It wasn't that nice. They'd be full boxes of hockey. Exactly. They were strawberry flavored and Oreo flavored. I think it was. Or oh, yeah. um, well, cookies and cream. I think. All oh, right. Um, Which just so happens to taste like Oreo. Yeah. Yeah. Sound. Wow, that's uh, that's really stuck in there. They are. They're kind of all stuck together, pasted together. That's funny. <laughs> okay. Pocky. They're basically breadsticks with stuff on half of them. Oh. That's very tasteless. Yeah. It just tastes like breadsticks. There's nothing there. Yeah. But as a result, you'd eat them like. Yeah. You know. I have basically a breadstick though. Mm. I'm fine with it. I'll eat that. I'd eat loads of pocky. Give me the fucking white chocolate pocky, please. So this. That's an angry looking bowl. It's an angry looking bowl, yeah. <laughs> hey. Is it a bowl? Kind of looks like fries from um, Aquatine Hunger Force. It kind of looks like it has a butthole just under its eyes. <laughs> a butthole mouth. <laughs> <laughs> this is where stuff goes out. It doesn't come in. Okay, right. Get in there. It kind of looks like it might be a similar thing to the hockey. Yeah. Yep. Kinda. Kinda? Okay. Okay. Is that pink? Yes, I think so. A little bit pink. If you can see that. Why is that flavour? I don't know, but it's weird. I don't know how I feel about this. It's so weird. I like it when I initially bite into it, but then afterwards I don't. It's so odd. 
It's like a whole bunch of different things. Check the book. <laughs> Check the book. Because I have no idea. That's very unusual. Wow. Mm. Sweet potatoes are a popular fall and winter flavor in Japan. But have you he heard of Murasaki? Emo? These purple sweet potatoes offer a creamier and sweeter flavor than regular sweet potatoes. Enjoy them as crispy potato sticks with a hint of salt. Okay. I had no idea what that was. Salty sweet potato. Yeah, I don't think I'm a fan. It's weird, you know? It's not a flavor. Hey. It's not a flavor that we'd often get over here. <laughs> crisps. More crisps. Tomato. Tomato? I'm guessing. Why are you guessing tomato? Just from the smell. Maybe not. These are original hula hoops. Yeah, they're hula hoops. Yeah. That's ready salted. It's the red ones. Yeah, they're ready salted. Hula hoops! Yeah. Everyone loves hula hoops. Original flavor hula hoops. Can't go wrong. Put them on your fingers and everything. Great. My fingers are too big. Your little fat finger there. <laughs> I fucking love it. And finally, whatever this thing is. It's like a fruit roll up. Chocolate money. Or maybe chocolate money, yeah. Actually, chocolate money makes way more sense. Is that what a yen looks like? Is that what a yen looks like? I don't even know. Actually, no, I spend enough of them. <laughs> <laughs> How many yen to the euro there? Uh, like a hundred? Is it a hundred? Maybe ten. It's something divisible by ten. <laughs> like, that's just, <laughs> that's, that's a joke waiting to happen right there. <laughs> uh. I think this is gonna be chocolate money. That's exactly what that is. Yep, that is chocolate money right there. Oh yeah. Good chocolate. Yeah, it's all right. Yeah, that's grand like. Yeah. That was the Japan crate. That's a box cleared out. Yeah. Once I said we've already made w one of these, and I'm pretty sure it's the exact same one. So, annotation towards the end of the video uh, to go back and watch that one. But for now, bleh. Bleh. The whole thing? Yeah, sure. Right, okay. <laughs> so, this is what? It's supposed to turn your tongue green or blue or something? Depending on which one you picked. Which one oh, you pick? Okay. I think I picked green. Okay. We'll see you in a minute. No. Yeah. Oh shit, I have a dentist appointment tomorrow. <laughs> I hope my tongue isn't still green when I go in there. Fucking hell. <laughs> um, yeah. Sorry, your tongue's infected. We have to chop it off. Bah! 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 Yeah, okay. Half my tongue is green. <laughs> yeah. The. Well, it works. Wow. The. 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 Okay, yeah. Nice. <laughs> so that was uh, the October <laughs> Japan Grey. <laughs> um, I have. One more. I have one waiting to come home and work. Okay. And I have one on the way as well. Okay. So, subscribe for some more Japan Crate videos because I have a bit of a backlog of them to go through. I'm okay with having a backlog of sweets, so like. Bah. 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 So, yeah. <laughs> some tasty things. 
a very plain crate overall. Yeah, I thought there, so too. There wasn't much to that one. Um, like, too much chewing gum. Yeah. Which just tastes like chewing gum every time. There's nothing different. There's nothing special about it. We have chewing gum here. Mm -hmm. um, the other stuff, interesting, the sweet potato stuff is nice to try. Um, but the crisps and the butter uh, cookies Jeez. and things like that, if the salt tastes like stuff that we could get here. Pocky was um, good. Pocky's always good. But that Pocky in particular was very plain as well. Mm. Like it just tasted like breadsticks. Yeah. Um, the orange juice, I don't like bits of my orange juice, so I'm not going to like that anyway. I I enjoyed that, but again, very, very bland flavour. The corgi. The corgi is probably the best. I, I don't know how this works. And this thing's cute. Oh yeah, the thinger. Yeah. But um, yeah, Japan crepe, less crisps, less plain tasting stuff. Throw some fucking green tea and bean paste and wasabi <laughs> and stuff at us. like. Give us some weird shit. Yeah. I'm not getting this to taste things that I can taste in Tesco's, like. Um, yeah, nice crepe overall. And uh, we have a few more to go through, so we'll be opening a few more of these coming up. Don't forget to like and comment. Let us know what you thought of the stuff that we had in this month's uh, Japan crate. And, uh, yeah, we'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.